ton of money, so guess what we're gonna do? We're gonna spend some goddamn money. We beat all the best teams. Yusei's maxed out on hearts, so after we spend this money, guess what? We're gonna do the final story of Yusei. Alright, let's get, uh... I have money now, so I'm gonna buy all his junk cards, even though I don't want them. I'm gonna buy... What's this? Guided by the Wind. Sure, let's buy some wind cards. All of them. I'm rich. Um, it's the only time I'm going to be able to do this, so I'm enjoying it. Oh, look at me. I'm rich. I can buy all of it. Nobody can stop me. I can buy all of it. No one can stop me. I feel like I'm on top of the world right now. Um, What the hell? No, I don't want these cards. I, don't want the I do like Jack. I do like Jack. I'll get some of Jack's cards. Who's this over here? Team Unicorn and Team Ragnarok? Nah. Leave them be for now. I want to be the master of spell cards. Give me some spells. Um, give me swords. Um, you know what? Give me some more of these cards. Even though they're not really my kind of cards, I'll still take them. I already got Mirror Force, so I'm feeling good about that pack. Eh, a few of these cards. And... One of these. Only one of those. And one plant pack. And I have 80 bucks left, so I can buy... I already got Dark Hole. Let's get a Novice Monster Pack. There we go. Alright, we're gonna be eating good today. Let's see what we get. We got Sword Hunter. No thank you. We got Wolf. Really good card. We got Gear Freed. I like that. We got that card. Not really what I'm looking for. We got another Graffa. We got two Graffas in today's stream. Not bad. On YouTube, it's probably different episodes. But in today's stream, not bad. Alright. Blockman. I, I have that card in real life. The Gates of Dark World, alright. Alright. Come on, game. Give me something I recognize and like. No. Stray Lambs can be good. I can use Stray Lambs. Alright. Dark World Dealings can be good, definitely. Eudoria, hell. Dream Clown, there he is. Hey, Yubel's second form. Yubel's second form again. Yubel final form. Okay, I have all the Yubels. Hey, that Flame Sprite guy is pretty good. Wall of Revealing Light, nice. Spirit Reaper, nice. Hell yeah. I don't know if any of these packs even have uh, Black Skull Dragon. Don't tempt me, I might make a Yubel deck one day. And I have some more dark monster support. Because I don't have Mystic Tomato. I have like nothing for dark monsters. Alright, Threatening Roar. That's good. Yes, Rick. You saw Jackal. I used it in the de in my deck in the beginning of the stream. But uh, I took Jackal out because he was filling up. He was taking up too much space. We never lost a duel though. But I never summoned him. Compulse is pretty good. Widespread Ruin. There we go. Does to hear a dogma? I want plasma, but I'll take a dogma. Divine Sword Phoenix Blade. Okay, come on, give me, give me plasma. No, no, no. I want plasma. No, come. You know what, Comrade? I like. He's good for warrior decks. Comrade's fine. Reinforcements of the army. Okay, really good spell card. Needed that. In fact, a vital spell card. Yeah, we got plasma, everybody. There we go. Now give me scapegoats. Heal for the legend. There we go. Oh, no, give me Destiny and Dragoon. I got Plasma and I got Dogma. Give me Dragoon. Unless I already have it. I don't remember. Either way, give me Dragoon. Alright, we got Dogma again. We got Freed. We got Freed. We got Cyberblader. You gotta love Cyberblader. I got two Cyberbladers because the game can't help itself. No. I remember Little D from Duel Monsters. 
Oh, the D. Yeah, that's Aster's uh, adopted father, right? And also murder of his father. <laughs> this here a Diamond Dude. Finally, I've been waiting on Diamond Dude. All right, we have not gotten Diamond Dude yet, so I'm glad we pulled him. Well, Nature's Release is actually pretty good. Beast Soul Swap can be very good. Harpelay 3, I didn't have one of those. Swallow's Nest can be very good. Alright, anything else? Harpy Queen, I can... Okay, I needed one more Harpy Queen, that's for sure. Harpy's Brother, I don't even know if I want to run that, but I like Harpy's Brother. Harpy Queen again, good, good, good. Our deck's going to go through some improvements right now, I'll tell you that for, for sure. We're going to make some improvements. Crystal Beast Sapphire Pegasus, holy crap, that's a really hard card to get. Wild Nature's Release. The King of Beasts, hell yeah. I have a million Elgin Egotists. Beast Fangs. Harpy Lady 3, Speaks to Leah, no thank you. I got Harpy Lady 1 again. Maybe I'll just run three Harpy Lady 1s. That might be a good idea. Take out Cyber Heart. Ooh, Icarus Attack. Okay, now I have two. All right, my deck's going to go through some changes right now. I guarantee you we're going through some changes. All right, we're going to get some Wind Monsters while we're at it. We got Digusto Freeze. I don't know what that is. Arm Dragon Level 3's in this pack? Oh, shit. Ultimate Insects in this pack? Oh, shit. That weird fox thing was cool. Swift Birdman Joe's in this pack? Oh, man. Our deck is definitely going through some changes. Alright, anything else? Bladefly can be useful, no joke. Um, no. No, that doesn't look like cards I know. That Wind Rock Valley card was actually not bad. Alright. Ultimate set level 7. I need Armed Dragon stuff too. Give me Armed Dragons. Give me Flying Kamikiris. I need Flying Kamikiris as well. I know, right? That's weird, Corpse King. None of the... A oh, wow! Rising Air Corps. That could be useful. Uh, none of the AIs know what it is, I guess. I mean, they're not surprised by it. Digusto Phoenix. We got a Exceed Monster. I actually could use it in this deck, too. Arm Dragon level 10? I pulled on level 10? Kaizijin. Hey, old school. The hell was... What are these level 10... Shiny Black Sea. I don't know what that is. All right, we got some Yusei cards coming our way. We spent $15,000. We're going to have a full U YouTube episode dedicated to this pack opening. Ooh. Oh, no, the last deck I used was a fish deck. And then the deck, the, uh, the stream before that, I used a frog deck. Last week was fish. Two weeks ago was frog. And today is harpy. It's kind of just wing beast, beast monsters. But I'm going to turn it into a harpy deck. Now that we got more support. Not a full-on Harpy deck, but a close enough deck. Alright, Catapult Warrior. I don't know that card. You say he's used so many different Synchro Monsters over his years in the in the 5D show. One for one! Ooh, okay, that was good. One for one is definitely something I can use. Junk Destroyer, nice. Alright, let's see if I can get myself a... Uh, not Dread Dragon. Nothing I'm trying to build, but uh, just if I get cards that I like, I put together a deck. Right now, I just made Harpies because they were. I had a bunch of Wing Beasts. Vice Dragon's good, too. Also, a piece Golem. I want a Dark Resonator. Come on, game. <laughs> that makes sense, agreed guy, because most of the time, I Yu-Gi-Oh! doesn't really change because I've been playing all the same game. I mean, all the same era of games. 5Ds is probably the newest I've ever played. Not counting Millennium Duels, I guess, but Millennium Duels, I still kind of just used old cards because the game only gave me old cards. All right, let's go ahead and go to Rarity. We got another Grappa. We got Wall Revealing Light, which is amazing. We got a Spirit Reaver, which is really good. We got Reinforcement of the Army, which is amazing. We got another Plasma, which we needed. We got Swallow's Nest, which I could use right now. We got Icarus Attack, which is amazing. I needed one more. We got Anterior Giant. We got Dragoon Phalanx. We got this card, Guided by the Wind. What the hell? Uh, We're going to use that. Uh, We got one for one. We got Vice Dragon, Gates of the Old World, Threatening Roar, Nightmare Still Cage, Compulse, uh, Desiero Diamond Dude. That was really good. 
Uh, King of Beasts. Yeah, we got 545 cards, by the way. This game is way better than any other Yu-Gi-Oh! game. Tag Force, you can actually buy cards. You play the older games, or even the newer games, you only get like 7 cards a duel. That makes no sense to me. You only get like 7 cards a duel, that's not enough. But Tag Force, you get what you deserve. You definitely get what you deserve. Alright, so... We're gonna do this. We're gonna mix it up. Um, I completely forgot all the new cards I got, but we're gonna start off with Harpy. Alright. Uh, throw another Harpy Queen into my deck. Harpy's brother is nice, but I don't think I want one. We're gonna, we're gonna get rid of... I know it's weird. Cyber Harpy Lady can be definitely helpful. Or can definitely be helpful, but we're actually gonna get rid of Cyber Harpy Lady. Wherever she is. Where's Cyber Harpy Lady? There she is. We're gonna get rid of Cyber Harpy Lady. We're gonna get Harpy Lady 1. Exactly, agreed, guy. This game is just... This game is pure. So much wind. The wind is the point. We want wind. We want wind more than anything. Alright, we got three elegant egotists now. We got five... We have six harpy monsters, which is the max you can have. Um, and three elegant egotists. We're probably gonna have to take out some other cards, but right now, cards we are not... No longer gonna need. Elephant the elephant. Goodbye. Card trooper... <sighs> He's too useful. Maybe I'll keep him. Sangan is a little slow. We can get rid of Sangan. Um, let's see. DD Warrior Lady is useful in certain situations, but we're going to attack her out. Uh, Chiron is still useful in some ways, so I'm going to leave him in. We're going to go over and see Wing Beast Monsters now. And look at this. Look how easy it is to find the monsters you want. You just press R2 and square, and bam. Boom, you found everything you wanted. I got this bird. I got this bird. I got Miss Valley bird. I got Rock bird. I got Trophosphere. I got Swift Birdman Joe. Gotta love Joe. Ah, uh, we got this Dragoonity cards. Harpy's brother. If Harpy, li if Harpy, I mean, if Elegant Egotist worked, I would use Harpy's brother, but I wish it worked with that. No. Battle Storm, you can gain 100 attack for each face-up Wind Beast monster you control. Once per turn, if you control three or more face-up Wind Beast monsters, you destroy one small trap card. No, I'm not going to use you. Uh-huh. His name is his name is Harpy's brother. Don't you ever forget that. Garuda could actually be useful. Especially since I do run some tribute. Hunter Owl could be useful. Hunter Owl could definitely be useful. Raleigh's the Starbird can even be useful. The Atmosphere, this card is way too high level for what it is. Uh, Miss Valley, oh wait, this guy could be my new tuner. Oh, hell yeah. This guy's my new tuner. This guy is my new tuner. Where's my old tuners? Who else? Fable Cats, you know what, you're a good cat. You're out of here. Uh, we're not going to need two Harpy's pet baby dragons. They're bricks. You don't want to draw two bricks. You're Wing Beast, so you still work. Oh, I need to type in Icarus. I, I mean, I need to type in Wing Beast, actually. Oh, wait, it's right there. Perfect. I already did that before I made the deck. So we type in Winged. And then you just find any card with Winged in the name or in the description. It's so good. It's so good. Thank you, Inuyasha guy. But literally, this is amazing. This is the best search menu you're ever going to find. Dragoony, Dark Sphere, Mountain. Another Icarus attack, yes. Swallow's Nest is a very brutal card. I like it. All monsters you control gain 200 attack for each of you removed from play. I don't really remove them from play, so we're going to leave that alone. We're going to take a look. I feel like I'm forgetting some of the cards I just pulled. There were a lot of cards. I like Blue Wing Crown as well. If I run a, a Rising Air Current deck, I probably will. Um, something I'm sad about, I didn't pull any more field spells. I only have one Harpy's Hunting Ground, but I guess we'll make do. We'll just make do. Ugh, I'm starting to feel like Car Trooper might be more, uh, more trouble than he's worth. But he is draw power. Do I really want to throw away these cards? It's not like I have any, I don't have any revival cards is the problem. I really don't. I don't have any revival cards. You know what? I'm gonna... I know Harpy's Pet Dragon is really what's slowing me down, but screw it. I love... You're not gonna run... If you're running a Harpy's Dragon... I mean, a Harpy deck, you better run Harpy's Pet Dragon. It's a rule. 
You know what? I'm gonna say Car Trooper's slowing us down somehow. I don't know how he's slowing us down, but he's slowing us down. Now, this deck is way more Harpy focused, and we're gonna go- Oh, I should save the game. We have not had a crash in a long time ever since we turned off Destiny Duel- I mean, Destiny Draw, but we should still save the game. Um, we're gonna go ahead and just do the next story mode. Whoops. Let's go ahead. It might- it's- I think it's the final story mode for Yusei, but let's do it. Sometime again. So, if you guys stay- um, we're probably going to need to pick a new partner for the next story mode. So anyone that's here will get to pick the new partner. You don't get to pick right now, though. But you do get to pick later. Good, I'm glad. Let's head out. Alright, let's go see all our friends. We beat this. We beat every one of the baddies. We beat Zone last, uh, last stream. So there can't be anything left. It's just me and my bro. Look, it's the town you saved. You also saved them too, you say. Of course, it's not just your power and it's not just mine either. It took the strength of more than just one person to ensure the town's safety. I know everyone on Team 5Ds thinks of you as one of us, Cooper. But, there's one thing that I must do to before the end. I must make a decision. We've learned so much about each other, and our bonds that unite us have brought us close, uh, so close. It's okay. Nothing needs to be said. I can tell what you're thinking by your facial expression. Hey, Wait a minute. No tag duel? Just a straight up one-on-one? -on -one? I'm down. I am really down. We're about to fight him at his strongest. Yusei Fudo, final story mode, is him as your opponent, as at his strongest. He's no longer our partner. Let's go. Ah, shit, he went first. You know what? That could be good for me. So, this is going to be Yusei at his absolute best. Hopefully, I can beat him. We both got 15. Oh, I forgot the extra deck monster. That's what I forgot. I did forget the extra deck monster. First turn assault mode? No thank you. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and activate Harpy Queen. I'm going to assume we're going to get hit by some sort of negation or destruction. I'm going to activate uh, Harpy's Hunting Ground. Let's see how good of a guesser you say is. I play Reasoning. Level 7 and there's no way. Okay! This is why I played Harpy's Hunting Ground first. Now, because I got a Harpy card, I'm going to be able to destroy one of his back row. Perfect. I got rid of TT. Then I'm going to summon Harpy Queen, and I'm going to get rid of the other back row. And goodbye, Scrap Iron Scarecrow. Goodbye, that card. Hello, Yusei's life points. All right, I attack. It was a 2,000 defense point monster. I was smart to do that. And I attack with Harpy Lady 1. That reasoning worked out real well. I end my turn. Next turn, I'm going to summon my pet baby dragon and end this duel. Ah, my Harpy's Hunting Ground, damn. There goes one back, one, uh, one thing. I'm an old school deck builder, it's way easier back in the old days. Nowadays, I'm not really a deck builder. I mean, have you seen the decks I've made for my subscriber duels? Even though those are kind of limited, still, you can tell I'm not that good of a deck builder here and there. Alright, we got rid of Junk Synchron. If I draw one more Harpy card, oh, well, they, he has a scrap. If I draw one more Harpy card, he's done. He literally can't win the duel. Because I'll, I'll literally pop his last card using my card. I mean, he'll, his scrap iron using my card's effect. If he tries to summon a monster, is a miracle summon, it's over. So, yes. Foolish Burial, that's fine. Level Eater, probably, yeah. His last card is a monster? Okay. Here we go, guys. And that's game. I drew Elegant Egotist. That's why you run three, everybody. Holy shit, do not counter my own summon. What are you thinking? I'm going to summon Harpy Lady 1 again. I was going to go for Sisters. I'm going to go with Harpy Lady 1 again just for the extra buff. Then we're going to get rid of his Scrap Iron Scarecrow there. That way he can no longer stop our attacks. Then we're going to go ahead and start summon Rock. Then we're going to go ahead and Special Summon. I can make anything, basically. What's this card do again? It's not face up, so that's useless. Alright. I can get a Piercing Damage Monster. That would be fun. Yeah. Nah, let's just trust our cards. We don't We don't need an extra deck, okay, guys? We never needed an extra deck. I attack with Harpy Queen. And that's game. We beat Yusei in six turns. Perfect victory. He has no hand. All Everything he had is in his graveyard. We took zero damage. Go, Harpy Lady 1. And there you go, guys. That's how you top deck your way to a victory. Elegant Egotist OP. 
And uh, for anyone that says that I was the useless partner, I just proved it to you. I was the I was the guy doing all the work. It's a shame that it's all over now. You've done so much for this town, and yet you have to leave. Pu Wait, why? Why do I have to? Are you kicking me out? No, I want to stay. No, wait, why are you kidding? He's just like, no, 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 you need to go. You need to go. You can beat me in a duel. You, I don't want you to become the new champion. Get out of my city. Oh, it's a shame you gotta go, Coopers. That's a real shame. I don't want to go. No, it's a shame. It's such a shame you have to go. Oh, uh, this bitch. <laughs> He's kicking me out of Neo Domino City just because I beat him in a duel. No one said... I never said I was leaving. He's the one that said I was leaving. All right, fist bump, you cheater. Fist bump. I'll never forget you, you say. I'll never forget you. Farewell. I can't believe I got kicked out. All I did was help the city. I beat you, say, in one duel. I got shooting Quasar Dragon. I got three of them. Oh, shit. That means I probably could have got Stardust from his pack. And that is the Yusei story mode of Tag Force 6. Now, obviously, Tag Force 6 is the biggest of all the games of 5D, so I will be doing it. I will be doing the entire Tag Force 6 series. Well, not entire, but a ton of the Tag Force 6 series. Um, so don't worry, we're not done. Just like Tag Force 3, I will do multiple story modes. Uh, this might be the only time we'll actually sit through the credits, but we're going to sit through the credits just to see if there's anything special. Blackwing Dragons. Shooting Quasar Dragon's cool, but I don't have Stardust Dragon. Don't you need Stardust Dragon to summon Shooting Quasar Dragon? And you get to see the animations in the end credits. This is all the main character's best monsters. Ancient Fairy Dragon. One of the only monsters to get banned. Uh, Corpse King. I want to leave it to main characters. The characters with a portrait, if possible. Because, uh, oh wait, is that Livestream Dragon? What the hell? Ew! That card has one of the best summoning animations in the- No, it probably has the best summoning and attack animations in the game. It is one of the rarest cards that we ever see get summoned, but it has one of the best animations. Oh, these must be Tech Genius cards. No, a statue, you can't. Uh, we want to keep it to main characters just so that we can get more rare cards. They did not give animations to Thor, Odin, or Loki. That's really a shame. You get all the Earthbound Immortals, but you don't get Thor, Odin, or Loki for some reason. It's a, it's a, it's a damn shame, I know. As long as they have a portrait, Corpse King, as long as they have a portrait. Oh, there's the final Time Lord guy. I remember when Rally beat the Rally beat Zone because he summoned that card and it had no protection. Callan is an important character. He has a he has a face. Oh, there he is, old school Stardust Dragon. That's a monster. Does that mean we're gonna see Crimson Dragon? Oh no, there it is again. Here's an animation you'll probably never see. Well, guys, that was Tag Force 6 first story mode, you say. The next story mode we're about to decide on right about now. Let's just, uh, hold up. Let's just, uh, jump in there. Well, okay, hold on. There we go. Takes a while for me to get through this. Alright, going back into story mode, we're going to continue it, which means we're going back to the beginning. It's Saturday, day 13, free card. Steel Swarm Sentinel. I still have all my money, I have my same deck, everything's fine. So before we get started, these are the characters you could choose from. You could choose Trudge, Crow, Akiza, Harold, Bruno, Luna, uh, Jack, Leo, or Carly. Those are your choices. Obviously we're not doing you say twice, so... Choose anybody that's on screen right now. Oh, shit. And actually pick the character you want to see. We got one for Harold and one for Leo. We got one for Trudge. Anyone else? There's a lot of characters on screen. There you go. You can see all of them. 
And Kalin is, uh... Kalin's not on screen, but he is one of the characters. He just doesn't show up till night. So you could pick Kalin, too. We got a lot of Trudge fans in the, in the chat. Alright, I'm starting to feel Trudge. Starting to feel Trudge. We got one Carly fan. We got a lot of Trudge fans. I don't see Trudge losing. There's 30 people in this chat, so I'm gonna... Or a little less than 30, but still. I'm gonna give people time. Everyone has pretty much gotten one vote except Trudge. Trudge is the only one that seems to be getting a lot of votes. As long as no one's changing their votes, it looks like... Okay, two for Leo, but that's not enough. There needs to be a lot more Leo fans. We got a Bruno fan. There we go. We got a Callan fan. There we go. All right. That's almost uh, everybody. What is that, like 12 votes? Just about 10 to 12 votes? I guess that's half the people. I'm going to give you guys a few more seconds before we keep going. You can, Corpse King, if you want. Alright, so if you're changing it to that, then Trudge has three, Akiza has two, Kalen has two, and uh, Leo has two. So Trudge is about to win. I'm going to go... Uh, there's a delay in chat, so I'm going to go through... Okay, wait, we got three for Akiza. Hold the phone. Alright, and we got two for Crow. Or one for Crow, I meant, sorry. Um... It looks like I'm going to be going with Trudge, honestly. It looks like going once, going twice. We're going with Trudge. We're going with Trudge. All right. I'm going to go start working with my buddy Trudge. The chat has decided. Anybody that doesn't like it, the chat decided this. I did already do Kiza before. Don't accept partnership. What the hell? Tr we're done, bro. Where is he? Where is he? You. Hey. We're done. We're not partners anymore. Okay. Get over it. I beat you. You lost. But you, sir, you look like a good guy. You want to be my partner? All right, so we're going to go to cards. The hell is that? Earthbound Wave, probably. There we go. And that looks like a Naturia monster. Goyo Guardian time. And Prototype is an effect monster. Its effect is when it's on the field, it's Cyber Dragon. What does the star mean? Does anyone know what Alexis is asking? What does the star mean? That's an effect monster. All right. It's Kangaroo Champ. Come on. You think I don't know Kangaroo Champ? Are you crazy? That's a legendary Chumley card. Okay. Let's see here. I have a level four and a level two. That makes eight. Alright, and so that's a level 2 and a level 4. They're going to make these hard on me, aren't they? Trudge, why are your questions so hard? Alright, we need a level 3 and a level 3. Alright, and then I need a level 2. There we go. And then... Maybe a star means I already completed their story. That's probably what it means. That's That sounds like it's right. Alright. Now, partner, how you doing? Oh! I'm sorry! Okay! Okay, I'll see you later then. Fuck you. <laughs> okay, Trudge. I'll see you when you're in a better mood. I'll go duel somebody else. Trudge doesn't want to be my partner today? Screw him. I'll go duel Jack. He's still going to be my partner, but screw him. Hey, what's up, Jack? How you doing? I need a duel. I beat you say pretty bad. Duel handicap? What? The hell is duel handicap? The hell is this? Alright, someone tell me what duel handicap is because I don't want to do it. Somebody in chat has to have played this game before, right? This is my first time. 
Uh, I, if I ever play Persona 5, it, it would take a long time, Ranger Dragoon, because I would want to do 3 and 4 first. 4 is probably my favorite, so... Yeah, it would, t it would probably take a long, long time for me to get to 5. 5 is really, really good, though. Very enjoyable game. Um, let's see. I'm going to start this duel a little aggressively, honestly. I'm going to go ahead and summon my Harpy Queen. And Harpy Lay's Sisters is just going to be useless uh, because I'm not going to summon it. I'm going to use it for a tr uh, a as a discard. Um, lose all oh, why would I want to lose life points? Why would they handicap me? I'm not a very good duelist. You know what? I'll even, I, I'm just going to assume he doesn't get Heavy Storm on the first turn. If he gets Heavy Storm on the first turn, I will be very upset. Alright. And I get a timer, huh? Alright. Good to know. Do I make more money if I win the, the duel? The only reason it'd be worth it is if I got more... Why would you set MST instead of use it? Oh my god, Elegant Egotist number two. You gotta love it. Harpy Lady number one, yet again. There we go. Just in case he has a 2,000 defense point monster. Nope, just Lancer Archfiend. There we go. I'm gonna draw my last Elegant Egotist, and this guy's gonna die. I still have two Remove from Play cards, too. So even if he does get Vice Dragon or something, he's going down. Oh, wow. I am really good at guessing. Oh, he's not in attack. Wait, Karma Cut still works. Yeah. He doesn't have to be in attack mode. Yeah, get your Vice Dragon out of here. We're not dealing with anything like that. I know you thought you had a chance, but you never did. Turn-based RPGs, they're a lot of fun. I like turn-based RPGs. Most of the RPGs I own are turn-based. Level 4, that's a good guess for him. Haha, <laughs> level... Oh, well, shit. Well, still, level 3, take this! Attack Mode Marshmallow! The scariest card in the goddamn game. I love uh, Pokemon Conquest. I've been playing that on my channel, that's turn-based. You guys like... And I love Disgaea. I haven't played Final Fantasy Tactics, but I heard it's good. Or maybe I... No, wait, that might have been the one I have played. But I don't own it. Oh, he lives with 100! You're lucky, you're lucky my reasoning didn't get me something better. Yeah, I love Disgaea. Well, honestly, some of the story modes are bad. I don't really like Disgaea 4 or 5 as much as the other ones. But I like Disgaea games. Oh, wow, my last Elegant Egotist. There we go. Harpy Lady number 1. Now that I have three Harpy Lady number ones, I could summon the all-powerful Harpy Lady Exodia. I'm joking. We can't make anything. I'm just going to attack. Well, Jack, that was a joke. Yeah, Jack's out of here, folks. You got jo you got jobbed by three Harpy Lady ones, a Harpy Queen, and a Marshmallow. You must have cheated somehow. There's no way the king could have lost. You know what? You better not lose to, uh, in two days in the redemption tournament, bro. I want to see you. I like you. What about you, George? No, I don't want to fight George. What about you, Lily? I'll oh, wait. I already fought Lily. They have different decks, but I see that one victory. The odds of them winning a tournament is not very good, Laser. Those characters are not very good. None of those characters uh, ever perform very well. Except Jack. He's gone third before. Mysteria's got a new deck. Matthew's got a new deck. Carly's got a new deck. What's up, Carly? How you doing? Alright. I'm going to go ahead and do a handicap duel. Biggest handicap possible. I have no idea what the handicap duel is, but we're going to find out right now. Oh yeah, Ranger Dragoon, don't worry. I was about, uh, Funny enough, I was about to test it. Just saw your comment. Lucky Star Attack is her new deck. Uh-oh. Well, let's see what a super handicap does. I start with 100 life points. She has 16,000, and I only get 30 seconds. All right, I like it. <laughs> what the fuck was I thinking? <laughs> what the fuck was I thinking, guys? This is stupid. This was the stupidest thing I've ever done. I can't use Soul of Morning anymore. Holy shit. <laughs> I am an idiot. 
Oh, and she started with her best card. Okay. It's a good thing I set my Harpy Lady so I could pop her best card. I flip Harpy Lady 1. What? Oh, it doesn't say flip summon? Okay, flip summon doesn't count. I, I summon Harpy Lady. With this, I could destroy your card. And now I don't have to worry about it. I hope. Joey did not win a tournament, I don't think. I think he got second. In the Battle City tournament, Joey got second. I lose! <laughs> Holy shit! Never do biggest handicap! Are you kidding me? <laughs> she could have done that in the first one. She didn't have to wait. Alright, Kari, let's have another duel. Um, I guess if I was running, like, Life Equalizer, I could I could totally win on Biggest Handicap. Let's just go with a medium handicap. Alright. Because that, that, that Biggest Handicap, 16,000 life. Yeah, honestly, I could probably beat her if I ran a Life Equalizer deck. Like, no joke. Okay, I get 4,000 life points, she gets 10,000. That's a little more doable. Because if she's running Magic Cylinder, I could be in trouble. I got I got a lot of good cards to start the duel. Okay. I, I, got, I got a lot of good cards to start the duel. I summon Harpy Queen. Um, I'm going to activate this card ahead of time. She doesn't use field spells, I know this, so we're good. Have Icarus Tack ready, have this card ready. Morphing Jar with this rock card sounds like a good combo. Alright, just set a card, set a card, set a card. Okay. Nothing to fear, maybe I'll even draw a Harpy Lady. Who knows? Oh my god, I drew a Harpy Lady. I activate Elegant Egotist. With Elegant Egotist, I could summon the Harpy Lady Sisters, because I'm actually going to summon her for once. Alright, and I'm going to destroy this card, because that's Magic Cylinder again. And just in case, I, well, actually, no, let it go through. And just, okay, I was wrong, that's not Magic Cylinder. I'm going to destroy this card, because that's Magic Cylinder. It was Mirror Force, holy shit! Holy shit, I hit the right card. I'm going to set Morphing Jar to get me a new hand next turn. And we're going in. Hey, Anime Andrew, how you doing? It's been a while. Good to see you. Alright, gonna end my turn there. I got Icarus attack just waiting. I'm gonna help her. I'm gonna help Carly out. I'm gonna get her a new hand. She looks like she could oh my god. She looks like she can use a new hand, so let me help her out. She probably has two normal monsters in her hand. Yep, she did. Uh oh, it's okay, I guess that misses the timing. Well, I didn't know that. Time I learn I'm learning new things. I'm going to go ahead and summon the Harpy Queen in order to pop that back row card. Uh, nope, no need to worry. It was another- wait, what? How could you have two Mirror Forces? That's illegal! That's not- that's not real. You can't have two Mirror Forces. Alright, I attack with Morphing Jar. Hey, I already knew your monster was going to be weak. I win. So, yeah, I could win a medium duel. I could definitely win a medium duel. I activate Swallow's Nest. I tribute Harpy Queen that just attacked to summon my uh, Harpy Lady 1 to buff the rest of my monsters for the rest of this turn. And that's the end of the duel. Oh shit, gotta destroy something. I destroy the Icarus attack. No one needs it. Who needs Icarus attack? I attack with Harpy Lady 1. I attack with Harpy Lady Sisters. And I attack with Harpy Queen. That's game. Alright, so as long as the handicap isn't me having 100 life points and her having 16,000, I can win the duel. I don't get enough money. For a handicap duel,